Namaste, good morning. Namaste, Shamla Didi. Namaste, all. Welcome to the morning session. So, we start with the, the sharing of Adelaide Didi. Adelaide Didi, Namaste. Namaste, Sunil Bhaiya. Namaste, namaste, namaste. Sharmila Didi. Namaste, everyone. Didi, I will put you a brief introduction and then you can place your sharing within 20 minutes. So, uh, Dr. Adelaide Dasa Didi, she retired from service as an associate professor of mathematics. Now she has a service of 37 years at St. Agnes College, Autonomous College, Bengaluru. She attended UHP introductory and UHP 2, she attended offline as a volunteer um, at RB College of Engineering, Bangalore in September 2022. So she uh, attends the morning session quite consistently, regularly. She also offers the UHP content uh, to the PG students in the same college, St. Agnes College. Yeah, uh, she offers this in four different batches. She is also attending all weekly meetings of the Western region from June 2020. And morning sessions, she had starts attending, started attending from January 2021. So she has been consistent in the morning session. So with this brief introduction, I welcome uh, Adelaide Didi for her sharing in the morning session. Didi, over to you. Thank you. Sunil Bhaiya for that introduction. Um, I am Mrs. Adelaide Saldana Nindesa, widow of Captain Herman Maxim Dessa, who passed away in 2018. I have two children, doctor, elder one uh, daughter, Dr. Krapa Bridget Dessa, pursuing her MD studies in general medicine in our town, Mangalore. And um, second one, son, Mr. Prasad Pidelis Desa, who just completed his B.Tech in Electricals and Electronics from NIT Karnataka in our own town uh, near Suratkal. This is so we are three in the family. Now regarding my sharing, emerging out of exercises one and exercises two. In exercises one, observing my imagination at this moment, the desire, thought and expectation with no reaction. Reaction happens, but not as earlier. Earlier, after the reaction only, I would come to know. Now, when the reaction is just to happen, I come to know. For example, just the other day, two days ago, I noticed when my uh, housemaid brought her daughter home. Her daughter has holidays now. So she had to bring her for one day. Suddenly I saw there is uncomfortableness in me. I asked, why this uncomfortable? Why am I uncomfortable? That, the answer was, I am feeling jealous. Why am I feeling jealous? It is because the maid will have attention given to her daughter as well as to us. So, so the samskar that I found was, I don't want the attention. I don't want what is due to me to be shared with others. So that small child, is becoming an enemy to me. I didn't like it. So I observed this without reaction. Is the feeling that you are uh, having at this moment naturally acceptable? No, definitely not. That's why I have caught it. I catch the feeling behind the desire, thought and expectation. 
and this feeling is not making me feel comfortable. Are you in harmony? No, I am not in harmony. I am not happy with the feeling that I am having at this moment. It is making me feel uncomfortable. Who decided the feeling? I have decided the feeling. To, be, to feel uncomfortable, to feel jealous, to feel insecure by the presence of that child. On what basis did you decide? Yes, that is my samskar that I am feeling insecure. So, which feeling is naturally acceptable to me? At this time, I don't want to feel insecure. The child is not going to do anything to me. The child is, after all, a small child. It um, it need. I told uh, that uh, child should be kept uh, in the on the terrace to do her work, etc. But still, I thought, oh, the the child will also uh, experience. Um, company if she is there with us at home. So, uh, then now I am able to uh, I thought to myself I um, asked myself do I have a, relation, a feeling of relationship towards her? Yes. I can have the feeling of relationship towards her. Then isn't she no, isn't um, is she just a, a human being as you are? Yes, she is also. And doesn't she want to make? Uh, do you don't you want to make her happy? Doesn't she want to make you happy? Um, is she? Are you able to make her happy? Is she able? She may not be able to make you happy. Okay, so I said, uh, yeah, I I have to accept her. With that. When I started accepting her, when she became my relative, I told her, I thought, let me involve her in my activity, in my small work, which I had uh, of uh, arranging all the books. And uh, after the painting of the house, I had a lot of work also to do. Those books will interest the child also. Therefore, I told, let the child be with me. I will, um, um, I will involve her. Can I asked her permission. Can I involve her when uh, I am dealing with the books here and there? She's uh, the mother and child both agreed. After that, the child and me both enjoyed the activity, and the day went on well. So. I I feel um, when I observe my imagination, yeah, uh, it is not always very pleasant, and I can get the get hold of that unpleasant feeling. I can get hold of that uh, uh, reason why I am having, and uh, when I ask those whys, I come. Uh, come to know about the samskar that is there behind it. Last time I had uh, reported about the samskar that I was very frightened when I had a, I had some, uh, I doubted that there was some disease in me. The samskar was um, that I am the body. Now that samskar is um, getting evaluated little by little. This samskar also, which I uh, I feel um, jealous of others, has also to be evaluated. And uh, I have to still feel that people are related to me. Which feelings are naturally acceptable to you? Feelings of relationship, not opposition. Feeling of harmony. Harmony is, um, for the feeling of harmony, when uh, from harmony in me, in me means even in my body, uh, when I want to eat, uh, 
something continuously in the sense not much I eat but little by little when I want to eat continuously I ask the question is it for your body or is it for yourself are you trying to get that happiness or by the by the taste uh, can you get this happiness continuously? Is this happiness continuously? And then no. That means uh, self is not in harmony. And uh, of course, I do not uh, eat junk food or I do not eat uh, food with too much of carb um, to... Uh, to get that, uh, to maintain, oh, to have, I have the feeling of a regulation towards the body. And so, uh, feeling of harmony, uh, maintaining harmony in the self, if not in the self, maintaining harmony as a human being, uh, I can do that. I have, uh, my health is improving. In the sense, and recently we have done painting, but I thought I will, uh, there would be so much of uh, dust or there would be so much of a uh, uh, smell of the chemicals, etc. And uh, I um, may get an asthma attack. But what I observed is, even though I was inside the house, we have a flat, so not much opening outside. So even though I was there inside the house itself throughout the painting for a week or so, the, not a, any bigger trigger was there in the asthma. I was happy because uh, this is the uh, first time maybe that uh, uh, asthma has not uh, been triggered and uh, I could just maintain with a little um, inhaler here and there. So uh, this has uh, the, uh, accepting harmony in the human being is uh, getting naturally acceptable towards the body. And now towards the um, self, I have to maintain. Coexistence or struggle, I just mentioned. Though I like coexistence, there is still struggle in me that uh, when others have to, there is that Priya um, Hitilab, you have to be of some use to me, then I will like, you means the another, another has to be of some use to me, then only I will like the person, I, I can um, enjoy the presence of the other person. Otherwise, I see a little struggle in me. There is uh, that um, competition in me. There is that um, oh, I am special or I differentiate. Um, that much I I found just now. However, uh, with people, I can adjust. In the sense, I uh, people find and people say that... Uh, oh, when I speak, it is very pleasant to them. And uh, only inside me, I can see the struggle. I I, I was just testing uh, in two, three days. I, uh, uh, I keenly observed whether I was feeling uh, comfortable or not when I was walking in the lane when I was uh, walking to the um, at, uh, in a in the road on the road on the footpath, when I met people, and as they were passing me by, sometimes I was feeling comfortable. Sometimes I was not feeling comfortable, and so I am making a differentiation. I am um, I like some people. I don't like some people. Uh, all that happened, and again yesterday. There was a small exercise for us to go through the list and to see a uh, list of participants and see whether I was feeling comfortable. Uh, again, that uh, coexistence or struggle and that struggle is still 
uh, and, uh, it is there in me. It was much before maybe. Now it is reducing. But when I see that um, others are also similar to me, when I when I uh, verify that um, proposal that others are also similar to me, then I switch over from struggle to coexistence. And can I ensure the feeling um, of uh, relationship, harmony and coexistence at this moment? I can, I can. For a moment, I can. And then, but again, it slips and then it comes. So I will be able to decide my feeling throughout uh, thought accordingly in a natural manner that has to that has to come. And I will always be comfortable within. I have to still to uh, see whether I be I can be I can become comfortable. I'll be in a state of harmony and happiness in continuity. Uh, that is uh, right now. I do not have it. I still feel um, frightened. I still feel uh, uh, not so related to others. Uh, okay. Uh, so, but it doesn't mean that I am negative uh, throughout the day. No, nothing like that. I feel, I like to be um, with people. I I like to uh, I can approach even um, strangers and talk to them. Even if they do not start any conversation, I can start the conversation. Um, that is what it is, and I can um, I can be uh, I can um, be in the company of people, or I can be alone also. It doesn't matter whether there are people around me or no people around me. Uh, I can be happy. And regarding the uh, exercise too, uh, I have still to see that uh, body and... Uh, uh, yes, I exist, the body exists, both exist, but uh, still I have to make a difference. Uh, identify that I am different from my body. I transaction uh, and transact information from time to time with the body. Yes, this one uh, I can see uh, in this uh, the season is uh, and it is very hot here in Mangalore and you and I uh, and we sweat uh, sweat profusely and um, uh, there will be uh, the skin gets irritated. Uh, at any time, if you uh, touch the skin, it can be uh, it can be itching. There. there can be an itching there. So when my self is not comfortable to come out of that uncomfortableness, I um, I happen to scratch here and there. While scratching, there is some sensation, or there is little escape from that uncomfortableness. And this, but this scratching doesn't stop. It it can go on till uh, there is a little small uh, wound there, and that will make the make it again uh, burn, and then it will stop. No, so I am, uh, I am trying to get. Uh, I know that the body was by itself. It uh, I transact. I transact information with the body. I from time to time, as and when required. When I need that, uh, when that uh, when session was required, I went scratch the body. I told my, uh, again, I was the one who uh, used the hand um, to scratch the body. So, and I am now getting that uh, sensation back again. So, I am the one who decides what instructions to be passed to the body and what sensations are to be read from the body. While reading the sensation... I am not the sensation. Yes, I can read the sensation taking place in any part of the body. Of uh, uh, yes, I can. Uh, yesterday there was suddenly my little finger uh, uh, fell under the uh, 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 this one under uh, somebody sat on it. So th there was weight on it, and uh, it started uh, paining. Uh, therefore, I could read the sensation taking place in, uh, from that small finger. 
But what I did was, I did not uh, uh, concentrate much day. I ignored it. I went on, I had to read something. I went on reading and there was no sensation. After the, In the sense, there was no pain. After that, the pain stopped. So I am being different from the sensation. There is difference between self and body. Sometimes I can see this. My interaction with the body or the world outside is by way of sensation. Yes, I read the sensation. I decide. I give When I hear uh, anybody talking to me, I give the meaning to that sensation. And uh, therefore, my re reaction or response depends on my samskar. And yes, um, just as I when I saw that girl, I uh, I um, interpreted that she is going to be like this, the maid will be like this, etc., etc. I, I interpreted so much and therefore my reaction or respond, uh, response depended on my samskar. It was the samskar where I felt um, the, that... Um, I should do get the attention. I should get the uh, uh, love and affection, uh, affection of the uh, of my housemate. So it should it should not go that side. I tend to react if my sensation is based on assumption, and uh, I tend to respond yes when uh, uh, this I can make out whenever I get. Uh, upset before oh, before reacting I stop there I see whether I can uh, respond whether my samskar is uh, for relationship or against is it for struggle then I stop no why should we why should there be a struggle and I wait and respond when my samskar is based on understanding. If at all, um, uh, if the samskar is based on assumption and I um, react, uh, then uh, and nowadays I don't feel much guilty. Nowadays, um, when it was told that um, we are uh, like those small children trying to walk, and then we could fall. The child doesn't get uh, uh, guilty there. Child gets up and walks again. I too do that same thing. I may be failing so many times, but I still uh, say, uh, this time you fell. Next, uh, there is another time. If it is, if, if this something is going to be get repeated, you are going to uh, you are going to see whether you can respond. How? And uh, I have seen some scars uh, being um, becoming weaker and weaker. Those some scars which are not helpful for us to uh, to understand that uh, uh, harmony, coexistence, relationship, etc. Those some scars are slowly, very very slowly, uh, getting reduced. Uh, ma about procrastination, a little about procrastination, I'll tell you. That is my, oh, that's another strong samskar that is there in me, which doesn't help me. Um, I um, I have worked a little on uh, pro, uh, procrastination. First of all, I am, I do hard body. I am, I want uh, whatever I think I should, uh, I want it. Um, immediately in the sense uh, if there is a task, big task given to me and I'm not able to understand it or it is difficult, then what I do is uh, this is difficult, I'm uncomfortable I want to come out of that then another task, another small task appears or that a task appears very important and I do that and therefore uh, when that work also is a little difficult I leave it there and do another one. Finally, I found that I don't want to do any work. But this doesn't work. I should do some work or the other. But then I saw that I'm not liking whatever work I'm doing. I said, this is not the, uh, this is a samskar. You have to start liking it. Therefore, even when I'm doing my uh, chores at home, I, I started, uh, I started saying, this chore is important. 
if this chore is done, then your children will be happy because they will get what they want in the sense they will get what they need, etc., etc. And uh, your life in the house will be comfortable. Then I started, I have now slowly started liking oh, the uh, work that I have to do. Uh, so, uh, procrastination is also getting attacked and uh, slowly, very, very slowly, that is also uh, 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 losing its uh, control on me so much. Uh, and then regarding I am in coexistence in space, bodies, yes, uh, I don't know how much I understand it as space. All this is there in me as information um, and uh, now I know what is information and what is understanding. If if I am saying, see, I may be good at saying things that one should be like this, one should be like that. But if I am not like that, that means that is an information for me that has not become an understanding. So there will be a difference um, in my thought and in my word and in my deed. There will be a difference because my word will be very nice because I have to impress you. My deed will not um, will not be nice because it has to come from the understanding. I have not understood. So my behavior may not show what I am saying. So, uh, so I may say I am in coexistence. Um, but still, a uh, uh, little one more uh, uh, space. I have the inform. I have information uh, as God, and uh, I see that uh, as uh, when I understand it as God, I see that whatever, uh, whatever in the intention, no, whatever needs I have, I can take it to Him, and if the needs are according to the natural acceptance then they will be granted to me that much i can understand that i am in space everybody is in space that much i can understand uh, thank you everyone i am very grateful to the uh, to all my mentors and to all the um, uhv uh, participants who are self explorers because uh, this this has uh, made me belong to a family of co-explorers where we are helped to uh, go through this journey of understanding the self and understanding in the material world and understanding uh, space. Thank you. Now, I uh, request Shambhala Didi to give her comments regarding uh, Adela Didi sharing. Shambhala Didi, over to you. Yeah. Um, thank you, Adela Didi for sharing um, you are you have been committed to this whole um, process of self exploration and uh, you have been consistently uh, joining the morning sessions also you are taking part in the volunteering activities also so all the best to you for your continued uh, commitment and your uh, process of self-exploration. I think um, though you have retired from active service, you are still teaching the content. So that's uh, very commendable. Uh, time is short, but maybe, you know, um, outside of this also, we can discuss what other possibilities there may be that you can, uh, you know, do not just exploration within, but also helping in the participation in society, what other things you may be able to do if you have the time and uh, certainly the commitment is there. So all the best to you. 